Veteran Salute is sponsored by the Devon James Injury Lawyers. In today's Veteran Salute, a World War II veteran was drafted at just 18 years old, making him one of the youngest officers to join his bomber crew. Richard Martin says years and years went by before they started having bomb wing reunions. He says it sure was great to get together, and I can only imagine the story swapped when you consider what his crew flew and lived through. Everybody came from a different state. And once flying missions over Japan, this B-29 crew had unwelcome company on the very first mission. The tail gunner calls in and says, hey, we got a thing about the size of a cigarette, cigarette butt on our tail glowing, and he's chasing us. It was a kamikaze. A B-29 at that altitude could turn sharper than a kamikaze with so short wings. So we got rid of him. Martin says every mission started about three in the afternoon and took 15 hours. We just flew all night and that was just the way it was. And all targets were the same. So we'd make a run from one end across the bay to the oil refinery at the other end. Martin says they had faith in their B-29. It would take you anywhere and bring you back. Hey, it was a good plane. And every good plane needs a solid name. Everybody else was putting half-dressed women on the plane, and we decided we weren't going to do that. So the crew settled on My Naked, and it went on to get them through 11 bombing missions. We started out, I think we had 18 planes on the first mission, and when we got to the last one, we were up to... 140 some. And although there were more planes and more bombs, one thing remained the same. The crew that was more like family. You, you just learned to lean on each other. And that they did until their safe return on Army Day. But I didn't know it was Army Day. And they had a couple of uh, uh, ships in the harbor spraying out these big water fountains. Well, we thought that was the way they welcomed everybody. Martin was studying to become an accountant when he was drafted, a career he enjoyed until his retirement in 1984. Now, while we were there at his home that day, he was preparing his taxes by hand, and why not, at 94 years young. Tonight, we salute Richard Martin for his service during World War II. We're honored to be here with Richard Martin. Richard served our country in World War II. He worked on the B-29s and also as part of the greatest generation. Mr. Martin, thank you so much for your service. I'm honored to be here. Thank you for asking me. Veteran Salute is sponsored by the Devon James Injury Lawyers.